Well, it is one of the worst cases of vandalism in recent memory. A church in Boulder County with anti-abortion messages targeted by vandals. Hundreds of crosses toppled and broken. The vandals use spray paint for abortion rights messages, scrawling phrases like, my body, my choice. The cleanup is expected to be costly and time consuming. Jeff Todd is in Boulder County tonight working on this story. And Jeff, this is the latest in a string of crimes that are targeting churches. Karen, in talking to the archdiocese, they have tracked nearly two dozen incidents since the pandemic began. Some of them vandalism, like what happened to this historic church. Other parishes have been victims of theft, and it is a headache that church leaders feel like they may have to continue dealing with. Very sad. Very, very sad. Bruce Fertha has yeah, been yeah. coming to Mass at Sacred Heart of Mary Church for more than a decade. He came on Wednesday to see the damage for himself. All of this uh, graffiti and stuff uh, is very much unexpected. You're sad, but then I was angry that, wow, they, they spent some time here. Just off of South Boulder Road, thousands of crosses were erected this weekend as a display for Respect Life Month. They've been vandalized in years past. I'm sure our crosses were a little bit of a trigger for people. They always are. People struggle with that. But most people have been pretty polite. They respect the fact that you have a right to free speech and you can do whatever you want on your own property. The damage continues. Graffiti on signs from the road to the 108-year-old church have anarchy symbols and support for abortion rights. It was a lot worse than what I had envisioned in my head. Buildings were egged. Windows were broken. Even a statue of Mother Teresa was spray painted. But then my heart kind of went out for them as far as you got to be really hurting to do this kind of destruction. Mark Evard is the youth director. He says people have been coming by all day to lend support, some from complete strangers. Drove up and he just goes, I'm so sorry. He said, this is so wrong. And just really, really encouraged by that. For the next few days, parishioners will be coming to Mass and still seeing these messages. Because this is a historic building, it needs to be specially cleaned in order to get this paint off the church. We're told that there is not a dollar amount yet for the amount of damage that has been done. Security cameras did see the people doing this, but we're told they don't believe they got a very good clear view of whoever did this. We're live in Boulder County tonight. Jeff Todd covering Colorado First.